everyone uh welcome to my youtube channel uh this is mr mlenga so i want us to look at um, question 12 okay so this is um mathematics paper one for 2023 gce candidates so under question 12 we have two questions we have uh, question a and question b so we are going to start with question a so for question a Okay, they have asked you to solve 5 raised to the power of a negative 3x, which is equal to 125. So, in order for you to solve this question, uh, here the base is 5, here you have 125. So, you have to make sure that you write this 125 in index form, where the base is also going to be 5. Okay? So, the way you can write this uh, 125 with a base of 5, you are going to say 5 raised to the power of a negative 3x is equal to 5 raised to the power of 3. Because if you multiply 5 by itself 3 times, okay? If you say 5 times 5, again times 5, it's going to give you 125 so that is what you have done there now from there you can see that the bases are the same here you have the base 5 and here you have the base 5 that is the essence of writing 125 uh, with a base of 5 so since the bases are the same you are just going to equate the powers so you say negative 3x is equal to 3 which is this 3 equal to negative 3x. So from here, you want to find the value of x because the question is solved. So we are going to divide with a negative 3. Even this side, we divide with a negative what? 3. Now, what's next? Just cancel. Okay. We just cancel. Where we say uh, this negative 3 and this negative 3 to cancel. You remain with x is equal to so uh three here one also there one so i'm going to remain with a, a negative one so x is equal to negative one so we have answered the question a let us now go to question b so question b reads the diagram shows a sector x or y the angle subtended at the center is 70 degrees and the radius is 18 centimeters. Calculate. I'm sure you are able to see the question there. Calculate the area of the sector X or Y. So, to find the area of this sector, the first thing you are going to write in the formula. Okay? So, the formula is area of the sector is given by this formula theta over 360 degrees times pi r squared so this is our formula now the theta there is representing an angle okay we go back to the equation which is 70 degrees and the, the radius there is this 18 that you have the angle is this 70 so just replace them there then the value of the pi you can check here they have given you which is 22 over 7 so when we repress here we are going to say area equal to so where there is theta we put 70 degrees over 360 times 22 over 7 okay times so since it's r squared so r squared simply means r times r so the value of the radius is 18 so i'm going to say times 18 again times what 18 so remember this is the paper one there's no need for you to use the what a calculator not so so what are you going to do what are you going to do? So uh, you're just going to say 7 here, 1, uh, 7 into 70 
it's 10 okay so this is what you have so this 0 from 10 you say 0 you cancel you also cancel a 0 from there so we write what we are remaining with so that we see the calculations area is equal to so basically on top we are remaining with a 1 over 36 times here the 7 is gone we are remaining with 22 times 18 again times 18 okay so what are you going to do from here okay let's check so this 18 that you have 18 year one 18 into 36 it goes there two times right so these two can also go into a t we say two a are one then two into this 18 it's c nine so on top we are remaining with one okay so you say area equal to we are remaining with one times 22 again times uh, one again times nine so just multiply somewhere okay you multiply somewhere where you say 22 times what nine because one times uh, 22 get 22 22 times one get 22 so 22 times nine so nine times two 18 you write your eight you carry one nine times two 18 plus that one uh, you are going to get 19 so our area the final answer here is going to be one 198 square centimeter this is our final answer okay in case it's not clear yeah this is eight yeah 198 square centimeter so this is how you can find the area of the sector uh, thank you so much everyone for having time to view this content please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel so that you can view more content that will be uploaded on this channel bye bye